There is too many kikuyus. There are too many kikuyus and kalanjins in this government. In, in cabinet, in principal secretary's position, in chairman of leading or chairpersons of leading corporations, and CEOs. That needs to be said. Enough of that. We are tired of it. You need to bring equity to the country. Let their, all parts of the country feel like they are part of Kenya. Let the taxpayers' money be invested in all parts of Kenya. That's very important. Yeah. Stop destroying people's homes if you have no alternative places to take them. Have places to take them, then I support the eradication of slums, personally. I think we shouldn't have slums. So when the president says, at the end of my presidency, there will be no slums, I say hooray, but I need to see a concrete plan towards that. It should not be just to... talking. Yeah. If they were able to address these issues, if he was able to stop extrajudicial killings, because they're still continuing, people are still disappearing. He said they would not disappear after Uru Kenyatta. But we saw how brutal this police force was when Raila was organizing his, his mandamano. There was no reason to kill anybody. I mean, for me, I would go to sleep and let them demonstrate until the cows come home. They would not disrupt anything, but demonstration they can demonstrate every, every day of the week, and it wouldn't bother me. There is no reason why police go from home to home taking people from where they reside and killing them. Those things should be things of the past. If President Ruto did this, he would be very successful and I would support his re-election. But he must do them. Okay. Linturi should not be walking free, as I said. This Moses Kuria does not deserve to be head of a chicken feed in my village. All right? He should be as far away from public office as Mwenje. God rest his soul in peace. David Mwenje. The one who was running around here uh, fighting with Utino Kajuang in the city. That is Moses Korea. He has no ability to be a leader. Namuchecha is not a leader. Should not be in health. And there are many of them that, that the only qualification they have is political expediency. And that is wrong. We have so many qualified, competent, ethical Kenyans to occupy those positions. So you see, I speak it as I see it. So those who think, oh, Miguna supported this. Yes, I supported William Ruto. I voted for him. But that is not a license to do anything you want. Miguna is a very active citizen. I believe in the rule of law. And I believe that all leaders must be accountable to the voters. That once I vote for you, if you don't do what I, what I voted you for, I have a duty to tell you that you are, you are doing the wrong thing. If I don't do that, then I've failed in my duty as a citizen. Have and, to hold and you accountable. I, for one, will not fail. I will say it as I see it. Where? This is Legrand from Simple Generations.